so my friends in uh, Arizona are into plant-based food, so I'm going to try some plant-based food here. This is my favorite burrito place here in Morganton called Mountain Burrito, and I'm going to, they know they, I know they have a veggie burrito, so I'm going to order the veggie burrito today, right here, so we'll see how good it is. Let's go. Join me, shall you? Hi. Hey, what's up, brother? How are you? Yeah, yeah. I'm going to try the veggie today, okay? And throw some potatoes on there. And, huh? Rice, uh, pinto beans, onions, pota the potatoes. Yeah. And make it the veggie one. Uh, jalapeno slaw, cabbage and lettuce, and some hummus, shredded cheese, uh, and pico, uh, some chipotle. I got my two veggie burritos, one for today and one for tomorrow. And so I got potatoes basically to substitute for the meat so that it'll still be like the same size. I usually don't get potatoes on my burrito, you know, because it's usually way full without the potatoes. So we're going to try the potatoes today. And I got some, uh, you know, I got all my fixins, my jalapenos and uh, chipotle sauce and stuff like that. I don't know, is chipotle sauce technically a, a vegetarian? I guess it is. I don't know. So, uh, well, when you, I'll snap my fingers and I'll be back home eating my burrito and I'll let you know how it went. Hello, little Adam. Yeah, not yet. Um, uh, $21. I did tip 15%. It would be 18 something without the tip, but hey, I like to tip them. So, because I'm a generous guy. So I got two uh, bags here. There's my chips, which I'll eat later. I also get the uh, smoky tomato sauce for those. Oh, here it is, woo. And there's my burritos. So yeah, I'm gonna put one in the fridge and eat the other one today. I always eat it like this with a fork anyway. And then I'm going to throw, uh, put a little bit of sriracha on it. You know, because I like that. It, just, it squirts out all over the plate. Oh, see, it does, it always squirts the wrong, I don't know why it does that. Put a little of that on there. And then I'm going to put some spicy guacamole from the Walmart on there because they actually charge an extra, what do they charge an extra buck for the guac? And I just, you know, I already got guac, so I'll just throw that on there like that, and then uh, I kind of mix this all up. Okay, so that is what I'm going to eat. It's got, again, my veggie burrito here. Just mix it all up and eat it with a fork, and you know, it's just easier to eat that way, especially with my beard. So I'm looking forward to this. Of course, uh, I always have my uh, heated up tea from the morning, my PG Tips tea, and my kind of a big deal. There it is. Okay, so there's my, there's my meal. I could get, some, I could go with some Coke, but uh, too much sugar. It kind of makes me too jittery. So the tea and the burrito. Let's go eat. So here I am in the studio. I just put this in the microwave for a minute. It is hot from the burrito place. It was only a 10 minute drive home, but I thought with the guac is kind of cold. And so I thought I would heat that up a little bit. So let's go try my veggie burrito. Yum. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Look at that. There's some lettuce. There's tomato. I mean, pico. There's, see? How long does it take before I drop something on my white shirt? Only 10 seconds this time. Yeah. And there's my potatoes. So that's kind of giving it the substance, kind of taking the place of the meat. You get chorizo. They have carne asada steak. You can get, um, 
of the chicken. A couple other things, some porky things, chorizo, I think I said. But this is their veggie burrito, and it is damn good. The, the potatoes kind of take the place of the meat, but I add the guac to it. I could get guac from there, but it's a dollar extra, and I already have a pile of it here. And I put a little bit of sriracha, and plus I got the chipotle sauce. Mmm, that is so good. Oh my God, I got good enough. <laughs> so, there's my veggie burrito. Again, my friends in Arizona, don't talk with your mouthful, said, I'm really, the you know, it's good to get more of a plant-based diet. I'm not 100% there yet. I still like my turkey occasionally. I still like a burger, real ground beef burger now and then, but maybe only once a week if that. But I'm going to try more of a, more going out and getting more veggie products. Now, usually when I get a burrito, it's not veggie. But this is my first veggie burrito at Mountain Burrito, which is right here in Morganton. They're open. They've cut their hours back. They're only open from 11 a.m. to 3 p.m. Wednesday through Sunday. So they're closed Monday and Tuesdays, which is a shame because I really like going there a lot. You know, I have to, like, schedule it now. Okay. I always get a second burrito, so I'll have the second one tomorrow on Monday when they're closed. But I highly recommend Mountain Burrito. Great place. And this is absolutely delicious. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. All right, just about done. Hey, sorry about the beard here. I know I you know, get gloppy food in my beard, but <clears throat> I hope this will be okay. But anyway, de absolutely delicious. Absolutely. I almost did not. I didn't notice that there wasn't any meat in this. The potatoes basically took the, pre took the place. You know, it's, and it's nice to have a... It's nice to have a burrito place that puts potatoes in there. It basically takes the place of the, the meat. So, again, an A+, plus, great, great burrito, lots of cool burritos. You can, you can customize them any way you want over there at Mountain Burrito right here in Morganton, North Carolina. Again, check them out, but they're closed on Monday and Tuesday. Wah, wah, but they need to be open more. I don't know, whatever. But anyway, um, yeah. Now, I know Chipotle has this, what is it called, sofritas, which is a plant-based additive you can put additive you can put on your burrito. So that's cool. I'm going to check that out one of these days, too. There's a, there's a Chipotle about 40 minutes away from me over in Hickory. So I will do that one of these days, too. Thank you so much for watching. Camo Dave, Mukbang right here. Microwave, and I'm also Microwave Dave. I did have to reheat this in the microwave just to get it a little warmer because it was... Hey, thanks for watching. Vlog under.